Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today I thought it'd be really fun to just pop in and show you guys a little bit of a mini haul. Um, my mom and I went shopping last night and then today in the morning and we got some stuff so I thought I'd do a little bit of a haul. Some are gifts and then some are just decor for the house in general. Um, but yeah, I just thought it'd be fun to kind of do a little bit of a mini haul. I haven't done one in a bit. I've been in school, as I said, so I don't do much shopping. But um, I, I really wanted to show you guys some of these items because I just fell in love with them. And I thought it would be nice to show you guys in case some of you are on the hunt for these. Or you want to, are you thinking of ideas for presents? I thought this would be really nice to show you. And I am going to incorporate into this video my part two of decorating. I did do a Harry Potter theme. I thought it came out really cute. I'm not finished with it yet, but I thought I'd just show you guys an update of what it's looking like so far. Hopefully you enjoy it. Um, I was thinking to do a voiceover, but I just feel it's it's faster and it's more convenient instead of hearing me just blabbing, blabbing. I'm just going to put on fast forward and you guys can see how it turned out. Hopefully you enjoy it. Um, but yeah, today was a good day. This morning I went on a ride with my best friend and I had so much fun. I haven't been, he has a horse, that's why I call him Cowboy. Um, but um, I haven't been riding in so long and it was really nice just to be out there in the early morning with her and enjoying the ride and just for taking it for what it is. I've been in school so I've been really stressed out lately but um, it was just so nice to be back in the saddle. I haven't rode in so long and it was really nice. We went early in the morning and it was just so nice being up on on his horse and just enjoying the view, enjoying the ride and um, overall he said I did pretty good so I'm feeling pretty confident it's gonna take a bit I am sore in the legs I am feeling it a little bit but overall it was fun so um, yeah and then afterwards I went shopping with my mom and I just thought I'd go ahead and show you guys a few of the items that we got so we'll just kick it off I'm not gonna go in any particular order I'm just grabbing what's near me and what's close to me so We'll start off with TJ Maxx. I've seen this everywhere, but on all the hauls, it's the Betsy Johnson gingerbread necklace. I have been into Betsy Johnson for quite a quite a bit now. Um, I used to wear a lot of her purses during um, high school, and I still have um, some of her items. I don't know if you all remember this. This is one of her rings. It does open up, and it has a little heart charm in there. So I've had this for a while. I haven't seen it anymore, but I bought this years ago, like during high school. So I like to wear her jewelry sometimes. And um, this one I've seen circling around in the halls recently, and I just had to get my hands on it. Um, my mom said it is my present for Christmas, but obviously I'm just gonna wear it now. I love the box too, isn't that cute? I just love it. And then obviously you got the necklace. He is just so cute. I love how he's shining. Sorry for the glare, but all the glitter on him. He's just so sparkly. He's pretty. He was $16.99. They had quite a bit, which was nice. Um, I would bear in mind though, when um, you are uh, purchasing, if you are purchasing one of these and you have seen them in the stores, um, I would just keep in mind or be mindful um, his some of them did not have the pearl on his little hat here so just keep in mind when you're shopping pay attention to that but I mean if there's very few I would say you can always buy and just add another pearl or just something there a little diamond or whatever it is you want to do but yeah I just be careful but overall I'm just so happy I got him he is so pretty I can't wait to wear him I am gonna wear him at some point in during my other haul or my other video so I'm very excited about that and then just kind of jumping in in between christmas and valentine because valentine's out right now but we picked these up these are for my mom these were from tj maxx 12.99 these are so pretty it's by that rachel zoe and um these are just so cute you can also incorporate these in your um christmas decor because why not i feel do what works for you and um overall it's just cute like i just love it i don't know if that makes sense but you can add these with your peppermint decor even gingerbread because it's red so i feel it work and then you can put a picture right here which is really cute but i really love these these are really pretty and also i think it's a great idea in your glam rooms it would just really amp it up with a pop of red and it goes perfectly with pink i just love these i mean they're for my mom but i like them too so we're we really like the cherry look and obviously that's just cute for valentine's and then she bought this cup this is really cute i haven't seen this one actually this was from tj maxx as well this was $12.99 and she is just cute. I haven't seen her, 
but she's just really really cute once again you can incorporate it with your um uh, your Christmas decor or even Valentine's obviously but for Christmas I feel you can make this work it kind of looks like the peppermint right there um this is from Joanna Parker so these are just really really cute I love this collection really really cute and it's that pop of red which we all love so from TJ Maxx my mom bought me these these were $24.99 I believe they're from Martha Stewart. These are so cute. I believe they're meant to be, yeah, it's a set of four of stocking holders, but these are just so pretty. Just look at the detailing on them. Just really, really cute. I love that all of these characters, they have like the jester look and um, you can make these work with your um, Valentine's even, but I love how their, their clothing is different. It's not like the traditional Mr. And Mrs. clothes. To me, they kind of match the jester look it's cute i will say these are lightweight so i personally wouldn't put um i'll take one out so you can see i personally wouldn't put a stocking on these only because they're very lightweight very very light unless you're going to put one of those little uh, mini mini stockings i feel this could work on there but um no i would just put this on we're gonna put these on my in my living room somewhere but my mom says she gifted these to me early <laughs> um but um, i'm gonna put them out in the living room so everybody can see them but she is just so adorable. I love the detailing on her. She's just so cute. And then you got Santa Claus and then the two elves. I won't take them all out because you can see them, but they're just so pretty. I love the coloring. They just look so cheerful and whimsy. I just love them. So I had to pick these up. She said I can have them early. So that's what she got for me. But these are just really, really pretty. So I had to have these. Continuing on with TJ Maxx, we did pick these up. I bought these. These were $10, $9.99 um, by that Rachel Zoe. These are a set of six ornaments. They are the cute macaroon ornaments. They're so pretty. I love them. I feel these can go great with my tree here because I have like the honey dukes or candy tree, if you will. And um, also you can have these out obviously for Valentine's or you can even put them in your glam room for all my pink girlies out there like me. You can put them in your makeup carryalls, which I probably will after Christmas and I'm just gonna have them year round because why not? These are just so pretty. They did have these in the, um, I wanna say it's still the macaroon look, but they're hearts. Um, but if I had to choose, it was obviously these cause I just love them. They're just so pretty and I love that they have crowns on them. And again, you don't have to use them for Christmas. You can have them year round because they're pink and that uh, white, that cream color is just so pretty. Very girly, very chic. So I had to pick those up. So we're just gonna, cause it's the only item from Ross, but my mom bought this. This was $5.99 at Ross. He's cute. I'm not sure where she's gonna put this, but we have a lot of nutcracker decor, but he's just cute. He's just like a little vase or yeah, just like a little base. But you can put, you know, your little arrangements in here. You can also give it as a gift. You could put candy in here and just wrap it. That'd be really pretty. But he's cute. I like him. We like nutcrackers. So picked him up. He is glass. Lightweight, but very cute. So yeah. Thought I'd show you guys this. My mom spotted this on the way out. Luckily, I just I was just, she was at checkout and then I was like, I'm just gonna go around one more time. Um, it was not there when we ran around the first time, so I think someone either put it back or they just restocked it. But this is by Cupcakes and Cashmere. It was $14.99. And I'm sure a lot of you have seen this, but we got the gingerbread pillow. Isn't it so cute? I love it. It, it is gonna go on my bed. I tell my mom I want it, so she's gonna give it to me. Well, lend it to me because it's for everyone, really. But it's gonna go on my bed for now. But again, this is by Cupcakes and Cashmere, fourteen ninety nine. It is. It's kind of heavy. It has some weight to it, which is nice. But oh, I just love it. So cute. Obviously, we're big on gingerbread decor, so I just loved it. And she was like, "Just bring it over. Let's just get it." We weren't gonna get it, but mm, that didn't work out. So yeah, I'm very happy with this. Again, it is kind of heavy, but it's really nice. I like how it stands. You can see the detailing of the cute uh, Christmas trees, the door and the little window up there. I think, yeah, so I love it. Had to get it. So I'm happy we did. So there's that. Now this item came from TJ Maxx. It's a gift from my brother. He asked me what I wanted for Christmas and um, I sent him a picture and he got it for me, which is really, really sweet of him, really nice. Um, and yes, I am, I did not know I'd get this, honestly. 
I didn't know it was kind of like a surprise, but I'm very happy that you did because it's really adorable. I love it. And of course, I'm girly, so of course, I love it. Um, so thank you. I love it. Thank you to my brother. Um, I really appreciate it. But this was from TJ Maxx. I'm pretty sure some of you've seen it, but I got this. Oh my gosh. Just take a minute and admire. This was $40. It's Juicy Couture. It's the purse set. Very cute. I have not seen these in my store. So when I seen this, I was like, if you're going to give me anything, I want this. And I got it. <laughs> so yes, I am going to keep it closed because look at the box. It's just so cute all around. Just look at that pink. Oh my God. The bow is adorable with the crown. Yes. Love it. I am going to, um, put this probably under my tree i'm not gonna use it until after christmas because i just want to look cute and be surprised again even though i know what it is but you know what i mean um but yes i was so happy that he got me this this is really really cute i love how you get the little baby purse right there and then the mama purse i just love it oh my gosh they did have um a hot pink one but i i gravitated to the brown and the pink i don't know why Obviously, I just love pink in general, but to me, this can work even in summer or even spring or obviously for Valentine's, but I just love it. I am going to try when I do take it apart. I am going to hook this one onto the big one and just see how it looks because just because it's cute and it's just so cute. I love it so, so much. They had a lot of um, kind of these kind of gift sets, purse sets. It was like Steve Madden and then I believe Kate Spade and they have like the really really small purses that come with these like you can only put like maybe a quarter in there or something but they're they're all cute but oh my gosh I'm obsessed with this so cute I'm so happy I found this and I'm so happy he gifted it to me which is really nice early Christmas present can't go wrong with that again I love the box that's a really nice box and um but the purses is the best part obviously so Yes, had to have that. And he knows I'm girly, so yeah, I will use this for sure. So cute. And um, even if I feel I don't want to mess this, the little purse up or get it dirty or anything like that, I will just store it in my little makeup carryall. So that's a good idea too. If you get one of these and you don't want to use this one because you're afraid to get it damaged or it just, you know, get um, ruined or anything like that, or you just want it to look cute in your glam rooms or your girly rooms, whatever you want to call them. This will look cute and then you can put like your makeup by it or your perfume bottles, whatever works for you. Um, yes, this would be so cute if you just had a little collection of the little ones on a shelf. Just fabulous. Love it. So thank you to my brother for buying this for me. Love it. Okay, so switching gears here a bit. I did stop at um, Five Below and the thrift store and Dollar Tree. So I picked up some stuff. I will start with the bookish item that I got. I got Six of Crows by Lee Bardugo. I completely forgot what this was about, but it's part, I don't know. I think it's part of the uh, Shadow and Bone trilogy, which I did read this, this series, um, this series, sorry. I do have these books, um, but I've always been curious about it. It's just, I've always wanted to find it on um, discount or at a thrift store. I just never came across it before until yesterday. And I paid $6 for it from the thrift store. And um, this book was really, really popular back in the day. It still is well known. Um, again, I'm kind of iffy with fantasy, so I don't know if I'll enjoy it. But that's why I figured I'd buy it like kind of at a um, thrift store or for a cheaper price in case I don't like it. I don't feel bad spending money on a book that I really didn't enjoy. But I've always been curious about this one. So I'm really happy I found it. And yeah, so I picked this up. Continuing on with bookish items, I found Snow Like Ashes by... Sarah Roche. This book was popular during the early booktube era when I first discovered booktube, which is I've been obsessed with ever since. Um, I've been obsessed. I, I can't remember. I apologize. I can't remember if this is a series or not, or if it's a dystopian or a fantasy. It's been a while, but I did remember the title and the author. And I was like, oh my God, this was at Dollar Tree for $1.25. Yes. So I picked this up. Beautiful edition. It's a paperback. Never seen this cover before. But it's really nice. I really, really like it. For $1.25, can't go wrong. But I'm really excited to read this. I've been wanting this for a while. Obviously, I'm not doing much reading right now. I'm lying. I did start reading um, Spy Family. The latest edition I got, I believe it's volume 10. I started reading that, um, reading that book. But once again, I haven't finished it because of school. 
but I did start it, so I'm not completely wrong there. But either way, um, moving on, I do, I'm very excited about this one. I do want to get to it as soon as possible. I have a bunch of books on it, and I say that about all of them. But um, I've always been curious about this one. I completely forgot what it's about, so I apologize for that, but I'm looking forward to it. I remember Haley and Bookland mentioned this a lot in, um, during the early, early booktube era, but yeah. I just, I wanted to get my hands on this. Luckily I found it at Dollar Tree for $1.25. Can't go wrong with that. So hopefully I enjoy it. I can't wait to give it a shot. Continuing on with Dollar Tree, I did come across this pink tin. I seen um, Crafty Girl uh, haul this on, on her latest vlog, I believe, uh, shopping haul. And it's just so cute. It's just a simple little tin, but it's really cute. You got your the hot chocolate and your coffee mug. They're just so cute. I don't know what I'm gonna do with it, but I can add it somewhere and it's just really cute. If I decide to give it to someone as a gift, I can put little goodies in there. Or if you're looking to give this as a gift and they love pink and gingerbread, it's just cute. It's very shiny, very well made. For $1.25, you can't go wrong. I think anyone who got this would really be excited about it. So I just thought I'd pick this up. Continuing on with Dollar Tree, I did find more of these um, Nutcracker candles. I just noticed when we were looking at them, they are different. So these, I believe, are holding drums. The ones, thankfully, the ones I hauled before, they are holding Christmas trees. So it's good to have like a different variety. But I did get this one in green. He has a little drum. They are very well made for $1.25. I feel you cannot go wrong with these. You can just see the detail on them. You can make them out. Like they literally look like, um, like they're carved out really well. You can see the, I'm um, sorry with the plastic, but you can see the detailing on their faces, his little mustache, and then the drum. And then of course you have the red one. And I'm very happy I got the drums and I didn't get like the same set, but this one's very pretty. Sorry for the glare. So I had to pick these up. And luckily now we have the ones holding the trees and now we have the ones with the drums. Dollar Tree did have quite a few of them, which is nice because I know people are wanting these. And then from Five Below, I just picked up some Barbie socks, $5, but they're really cute. I'm sure you've seen these online. Very pretty. They're very, very nice, and I've been needing new socks. And of course, I just love the Barbie. I love pink. And yeah, so I thought these were cute to buy. So I treated myself to a pair of socks. And then lastly, from Five Below, I've been wanting a new case for my AirPods. I bought the AirPods from Walmart a while a while ago and i've been wanting to switch up the case because i just had the boring white one but i'm always iffy about buying cases because i'm not sure about the size i'm not good with all that but um i wanted to try it so i bought from five below i bought the hogwarts express train it's really cute and it does fit my headphones perfectly which is really nice and i was very excited about it because i did not just want to have and have to return it but it does fit and it's so cute i'm so happy so Oh my God, I was just so excited for $5, you can't go wrong. So um, if you're looking to give these as a gift, it does fit really well. They work really, really well. It's very sturdy. They're not gonna fall out. They're, they're just really nice. I really love this for $5. And for someone who's a fan of Harry Potter, you can't go wrong with this. So um, I just love it. So in case you're interested, this was from Five Below, $5. So yeah, there you go. So that is it for the shopping haul. I will go ahead and play the part where the video that I filmed a few days ago where I am decorating another part of my room. I hope you all enjoy. It is a Harry Potter theme, so I totally understand if you don't like it. But um, either way, I hope you all enjoyed the shopping haul. Um, let me know if there's anything, any items that you guys like from this haul. Um, and I really appreciate you guys for commenting and join, joining me on my channel. It really means a lot to me and I'm happy you're all enjoying these shopping hauls. I'm sorry there's not a lot of bookish items on here. Again, I don't do much shopping anymore and I'm not trying to buy a bunch of books that I don't need right now, except exception for those two. But um, yeah, I am trying to read every now and again. It's just, again, studying just really preoccupies my time, unfortunately. But either way, I hope you all enjoyed this little shopping haul and I will go ahead and play the clip from decorating and I hope you all enjoy it.
so that is it i hope y'all enjoyed this video i really had fun shopping um spending time with my best friend and riding horse um his horse again it was a lot a lot of fun i'm really looking forward to doing it again hopefully soon um but yeah overall it was a really fun day today i had a lot of fun shopping with my mom making memories i did buy some gifts so unfortunately i can't show everything that i bought because in case someone in my family sees it i don't want them to see what i got for them but I hope you all enjoyed this uh, video. I hope you enjoyed the decorating process. Um, if any of you are not interested in the Harry Potter thing, I totally understand. But that's just what I like. Um, so, yeah, I hope you all have a really good night. And I hope you're all having a very good week. And I will see you all in my next videos. Bye!